Local school districts look at road conditions before making any decisions to delay or even cancel classes. Albuquerque Public Schools made the call today around 8.30 a.m., but some parents say that was too late. Action 7 News reporter Sandra Ramirez spoke with APS. <laughs> Ethan Sims and his daughters enjoyed the snow day after APS canceled classes. We had already planned our day around the possibility that the kids were going to be out of school, so it didn't really affect us too much. Although his family was prepared, Sim says he understands why other parents might be upset that the decision to completely call off classes came so late. It was about 3:50 this morning when APS made the decision to delay classes about two hours. But it was once the on and off ramps of I-40 and cores were shut down that they decided to cancel classes altogether. That was about 8:30 when many parents were already on the road. We never make the decision. To to delay or cancel lightly. Monica Armento with APS says the school district works with nine different agencies, including the Department of Transportation, to make a decision about delaying or canceling classes and says lessons are learned every time it snows, especially after a similar situation a couple of weeks ago. You can go back to just about any snow day we've had and looked at what the predictions and the forecasting was, and it's never 100% accurate. And that's why she says they have to wait for real time conditions before deciding. Safety is always the top concern. <laughs> Something that Sim says should have led to a decision much earlier. My wife went to work at seven and the roads were terrible. So I can't see if they were gonna cancel school at all, why they didn't just cancel it then. APS says the district has used all of their makeup days. That means the school year will be extended beyond Memorial Day. Back to you.